Stadium, located in Florida's capital city in Tallahassee. The fans are ready for a college football battle. And the rain looks like it's going to make things a little bit slippery out there for today's game between the Florida Gators and the Seminoles of Florida State. Here come the Seminoles. Welcome everybody, Brad Nessler here, along with Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet, and it doesn't get much bigger than this as far as rivalries go. These two Florida schools do not like each other one bit. The Seminoles don't seem to match up too well in this one. Kirk, I'm not sure I like their chances very much. Yeah, I'm going to have to agree with you on this one, Brad. Florida is led offensively by their quarterback, and he's the number one reason why I'm picking them to win this game. I look for him to spread this defense out and attack them from every direction. Big game today by the quarterback. And another thing, Florida has an advantage in this one, and that's their passing game. I look for them to get good protection, throw the football all over the place, and play like one of those all-star teams out there. Thank you, guys. The team captains are on the field, and this game is about to get underway. Florida has the ball teed up and we're ready for kickoff. Kicks it off. Number one fields it in the end zone. They'll start this drive at the 20. Number six lines up as a single back. Number 16 gives it up the middle. Number 59 with a takedown at the 24. A pickup of four on the play. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 24. Three wide outs here. at the 32 yard line. They grab eight yards there. It's first and 10, ball on the 32 yard line. Number six, alone in the backfield. Taken down at the 36 yard line. They got four yards on that one. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 36 yard line. They come out in a nickel. Number 16 drops to throw. He throws it. Number 21 makes the catch. Not a bad play there. Not at all. And if this wideout can continue to make plays like this, allowing them to spread the ball around, this offense is going to be tough to stop. It's first and 10. This is the fifth play of this drive. Number 16 with three wide receivers. He drops back. He's looking for his man, and it's caught. And they finally bring him down at the 15. Is this guy a natural passer or what? Yes, he is. And you just don't pass for over 3,000 yards and have a season like he's having if you can't throw the football. Let's have another look at that pass, guy. Well, Brad here is just a great throw by the quarterback. He does a great job of getting the ball to the receiver quickly. Therefore, the defense doesn't have enough time to break on the ball. First and ten. They're inside the 20. The Seminole go with the I formation. Number six on the give. Tries to juke. Number 98 brings him down at the 12. Just about three yards there.
Second and seven coming up here. This is the seventh play of this drive. Florida State comes out with an eye formation. Number 42 with a takedown at the 10-yard line. Two-yard carry by the fullback. The Gators bring in the nickel package. Number 16 drops back to pass. Complete, nice spin move. Number one brings him down at the two. Wow, how about that third down conversion? Boy, what a play here, guys. I'm really impressed with the poise of this young quarterback. He was very cool and collected out there on that third and long play. Let's see if they can punch this one in. On the ground, up the middle. And they make the stop at the one-yard line. And the fullback plows ahead for maybe a yard. Number six is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Touchdown, Seminole. The halfback ran it in for the touchdown. I'd give this guy the ball every time there's a short yarded situation. He's money. You mean he's an ATM, automatic touchdown machine. Where do you come up with this? They just come to me, you think. the PAT. A lot of game left. Four minutes remaining in the quarter. And our score, Florida State, seven. Florida, nothing. Florida State to kick this one off. He kicks it. Number one, pass at the five. He drives a stiff arm. First and ten, ball on the 34-yard line. Six DBs in the lineup. Number eight drops back. He passes it. What an interception by the cornerback. This guy needs to be playing both sides of the ball. He can catch the ball better than some of these receivers. It's first and ten. Ball on the 40-yard line. The Seminole come out in the ace formation. Here's a little draw play, a little shake and bake move. Number 99 with a takedown at the 37-yard line. That's a three-yard pickup. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on the 37-yard line. The Gators line up in a 4-3. Number 16 gives it up the middle. Number 86 brings him down at the 34-yard line. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. Third and four, ball on the 34. The Seminole come to the line with their jumbo package. Runs back to pass. He lets it go. Number 21 hangs on to it. Number 42 with a takedown at the 23-yard line. And they get the first down. That is unbelievable. Wow, Kirk, this quarterback's showing some big-time nerves out there. Third long is just like first and 10 to this guy. Yeah, you're right. A lot of poise from this young man. 
First and ten, ball in the 23. The Seminole come out in a two tight end set. Back to pass. Under pressure. Let's it go. Number 82 has it. And they beat the blitz that time and came away with a nice play. Trying to find that end zone here as they come out in the I formation. Cut, cut. Cut, cut. Number 16, hands off right side. And that's his second rushing touchdown of the first half. And the head coach has to love the way this kid is running the football. Here's another look. Tacks on the extra point. Over two minutes remaining in the first quarter. The score is Florida State 14, Florida nothing. Florida State to kick. Kicks it off. Number 11 fields it at the three. They'll throw the flag. Clipping, Clipping. on the receiving, on the receiving team. team. After this, this team is going to spot first down. down. They'll take over at the nine-yard line. Florida comes out with two tight ends. Number eight, back to throw. Here comes the pressure. Fires across the middle. And it's caught. Sheds that one. Number 42 brings him down at the 38. The tight end came up with a nice catch that time. Yeah, nice catch, and he shows off a few moves there. Yeah, the big fella's pretty athletic for a tight end. And as a quarterback, it's always nice to have a big target like this to go to. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 38. The Seminole line up in a nickel back. Number eight back to pass. He's looking. Throws it out there. Number 80 drops the ball. I thought he had that one, guys. Yeah, that guy will make that catch nine out of ten times, I guarantee. Second and ten. Ball on the 38. Number eight has five receivers lined up here. Rifles this one out to the left. Incomplete. He had it, but he couldn't hang on to it. You know, there's really no excuse for that either. He needs to make that catch, Coach. I agree 100% with you. It's third down and 10. Ball on their own 38. The Gainer come out showing three wide. And they got him. They put the pressure on, and it paid off. Well, his protection just simply broke down. And if that continues, this quarterback's going to have a long day. Fourth down and a long ways to go. Ball on their own 32. The Gators line up to punt. Number 20 signals for a fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 26-yard line. No 
will get the ball here at the 26. Florida going with a three-man front. He's hit and got away. And down he goes at the 30. The fullback gains about four yards there. It's second down and six to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Number six, alone in the backfield. Number 16, gives it up the middle. Nothing doing. Tackled for a loss on the play. Well, these guys fast or what? Good job of penetrating and getting to the ball carrier here. And that'll be the end of the first quarter with our score. Florida State, 14. Florida, nothing. We are ready to start quarter number two. It's third down and six to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. The Seminole come out in a shotgun. He drops back. Let's it fly. Number 87 with a catch. What an amazing catch, first down. Boy, Brad, you said it. That is a big time play there. Spectacular catch and great body control there on the long pass reception. First and 10, ball on the 42. Number six, lines up as a single back. Number six, gets the carry. He's hit and got away. And he's taken down at the 29. He picked up big yardage on that run. Oh, this is great blocking up front. Nice job of holding on to their blocks, allowing him to break through for some big yards. It's first and 10. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Florida State goes with the ace set here. Number six, gets it on the inside. Number 99 with a takedown at the 28-yard line. That misdirection play gets maybe a yard at the most. Second and nine. This is the sixth play of this drive. Florida lines up with five defensive backs. Number 43 brings him down for a loss. You know, when you spread a defense out like this and try to run the draw, you've got to be able to win the battle up front. Here, they just couldn't get much of a push at all. Now it's third and nine coming up. This is the seventh play of this drive. Number six is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Number 16, steps back to pass. And he's tackled at the 25. They try to play a little power football there. Yeah, but they got outpowered. Fourth down at six. They're in field goal range. Number 47 comes in to kick the field goal, and he's going to have to get a leg into this one. The kick is up, and it splits the upright. And he's got to be happy about that kick. Oh, no question. This kid is a solid kicker. Florida State ready to kick this one off. Decent kick, looks to be returnable. Number one, fields it at the three. Oh. 
They'll go to work at the 20-yard line. Florida sets up in the eye. They'll run the option. Tackle at the 20. No gain. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 20. The Seminole bring in the nickel package. Number 58 brings him down at the 27. Nice seven-yard gain on the quarterback draw. We get third and three here. Ball on the 27. Florida State lines up defensively. 3-4. Flag on the play. Number nine with a takedown at the 29. Holding, Holding. on the offense. On the offense. The Fourth and one coming up, all on their own 29. Number 14, set to punt. Number 20, calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 25. Start this drive at the 25 yard line. The Gators come out in a 34 defense. Drops back to pass, steps up in the pocket, looks, he unloads it, and it's incomplete. He was way out in front on that one. Yeah, there was no chance for the tight end to catch up to that ball there. Second and ten, ball on the 25. Florida comes out in a 3-4. Here's a counter play. Number 26 brings him down at the 27. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. It's third down and eight to go. Ball on the 27. Florida brings in their nickel package. Number 16 drops back to pass. Deep pass down the left side. Complete number 25 with a takedown at the 42. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. It's first and 10, ball on their own 42. Number 16 is back in the gun. And he's taken down at the 49. Nice seven-yard gain on the quarterback draw. Second and three coming up. Ball right around midfield. Florida comes out in a 3-4. Back to pass. He throws it. And it falls incomplete. And he just threw that one behind his receiver. Yeah, that was just a poor throw. I'm sure that quarterback would love to have that one back. Third down and three coming up. Sixth play of this drive coming up. The Gator line up in a 4-3. He tries to spin. Number 26 brings him down at the 49-yard line. Well, they tried to keep it on the ground for the first down. You know, Brad, here the defense just steps up and makes a play, stopping them and bringing up fourth down. 
It's fourth down, a yard to go. Ball right around midfield. Number 37, back to punt. Number one, signals for a fair catch. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. They'll take over at the 20-yard line. Nickel defense. Number eight drops back. Looking, fires a bullet over the middle. And that one's fallen incomplete. He just let his wide out a little too much that time. So it's second and 10, ball on the 20. The Gator set up in the gun. Drops back to pass under heavy pressure. He rifles it to the left, and they couldn't hook up on that one. Guys, he threw that one right into the coverage. Kirk, nothing gets a coach more fired up than to throw the ball at the coverage. Oh, wait, uh, <clears throat> you never made mistakes like that, did you? No, of course not. It's third down and 10, ball on the 20. The Gators. Go with the I formation. Number 44 on the give. Jed's a tackler. Brought down at the 28. The Seminole call for a timeout, and they've got two remaining. Fourth and two coming up on this one. Ball on the 28-yard line. They line up to punt this one away. Number 20 calls for the fair catch. And they make the fair catch at the 30-yard line. Get the ball here at the 30. The Seminole line up in an eye formation. He drops back. He's looking. He goes downtown. And it's caught to the 20, to the 10. And he will score. Fellas, he's really out to an outstanding start in this football game. Hey, if he continues at this pace, he may go for 500 yards. I'll tell you what, this guy is so much fun to watch when he gets into a rhythm like this. And he tacks on the extra point. So with less than two to go in the second quarter, our score is Florida State 24, Florida nothing. Florida State is ready to kick it away. Number one and number 11 back deep to return, and they'll be returning this one. Number 11, pass it at the five. Good coverage by the kicking team. Yep, beautiful job of playing their assignments right there. First and 10, ball on their own 17. Florida State brings in their nickel package. 
straight, drops the throw. He fires right. They call it out of bounds. No catch. Good call by the official. The receiver made a tremendous catch here, but you can see clearly he didn't have possession of the football when he was in bounds. So it's second and 10. Ball on the 17-yard line. Florida lines up in a double tight set. Number eight, back to pass. He's in trouble. He's looking for his man. They lose three yards there. Third and 13 coming up. Ball on their own 14. They'll use a 4-4 defense here. up the middle spins up field number nine with a takedown at the 20-yard line the Seminoles are going to take a timeout and they'll have one timeout left fourth down and seven coming up ball on the 20 number 14 to put this one away Number 20 signals for a fair catch. He hauls it in at the 41. They'll go to work at the 41 yard line. The Seminole have five receivers on this play. Back to pass. Looks complete. They'll bring him down at the 48. And that was a big pass play. First and 10, ball on the 48. Florida State comes out in the shotgun. Number 16, steps back to pass. Looking. Caught out of bounds and incomplete. Great effort here by the wideout, but you know what? The quarterback was off just enough to cause that incompletion. Second and 10, ball right around midfield. Number 16 lines up in the shotgun. He passes it. And it's caught. Number 25 brings him down at the 40-yard line. Not a bad pickup that time. Yeah, but let me tell you the reason why this play worked. The defense came with pressure, but they couldn't quite get to the quarterback. And he made them pay right there. Complete. And down he goes at the 26-yard line. A nice pass play there. Let me tell you, the reason why this play worked was the fact that the defense didn't do a good job of knocking the wide receiver off his roof. You got to jam him at the line and throw their timing off. And it's caught. He's at the 20. Knocked out of bounds at the 12. A nice completion to the tight end. A good play here. And the thing that I notice is that he provides a nice big target out there for the quarterback. It's first and 10. Ball on the 12. The Gators use a four-man front here. Number 16, options out to the right. He fakes a pitch. Number 59 with a takedown at the seventh. They get five yards on the play, and they hurry up to the line. You're right. Sometimes you can catch the defense napping a little bit. Number 16 drops back to pass, and it's incomplete. Florida lines up in a dime defense here. Number 16 drops back. He lets it go. Touchdown, Seminole. 
And he just hauled in his second touchdown catch of the day. The defense needs to put somebody on this guy before he does some serious damage. Getting pressure on the quarterback is also key. You can't let this guy play pitch and catch with his receivers all day. Down to just a few seconds left here before the half. And our score, Florida State 31, Florida nothing. Florida State lines up for the kickoff. Here's the kick. Number 11 takes it from the six. They'll start this drive at the 21. High formation here. Forty-four on a counter. He's out to the thirty. He spins around, brought down at the thirty-five, and we've reached halftime here. The score at the break: Florida State thirty-one, Florida nothing. We'll see what kind of halftime adjustments were made as we prepare to start the second half. He kicks it. Number one fields it at the seven. He stiff arm. They'll take over at the 19 yard line. Nickel defense drops back to pass. He wants it all going long. Number 27 bats it down. Great defensive effort that time. Did you see how that safety played that ball? That was a beautiful play. Second and 10, ball on the 19. The Seminole line up with six defensive backs. And they make the stop at the 19. Nothing gained on the play. Third down and 10 coming up. Ball on the 19. Florida State lines up with five defensive backs. He drops back. He guns it to the right. Number 11 makes the catch. That's the arm strength we've been talking about all week, guys. Yeah, and we get a chance to see it again here. Wow, what a throw. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 49. Florida comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Number 44 on the talk. And he stopped behind the line. And the blitz might have caused that one. Now the defense took a chance here. They overloaded that side of the ball, and the tailback had nowhere to go. Second and 11 coming up. Fifth play of this drive coming up. The Seminole line up in a nickelback. Let's it go. 
Number 42 tips it away. That one could have been an interception. Third and 11 coming up here. Ball on the 48. Number eight lines up with five wide out. Number eight drops to throw. Throws it out there. Complete. He's at the 40. Number three brings him down at the 38-yard line. They convert on third and long, guys. With the offense coming through in a big way that time, how about the timing on that route, Coach? Yeah, Kirk, the quarterback was able to throw to a spot, and the receiver was there to catch it for a first and ten. Nice play. First and ten. This is the seventh play of this drive. The Seminole line up with six defensive backs. Back to pass. Let's it fly. And it's caught. And they hit him in the backfield. And stopped for a six yard loss on the play. Second and long coming up here. Eighth play of this drive coming up. Number eight has five receivers lined up here. Drops back to pass. He unloads it. Number two hangs on to it. And a nice catch by the wideout that time. Third down and four coming up on this one. Ball on the 32-yard line. Florida goes with the ace set here. Number eight, back to pass. He throws it. Complete. Throws a stiff arm. There's a missed tackle. The 10. He's going to take it to the barn. Touchdown. What a catch and a big touchdown from the tight end. I'll tell you, this tight end is a big-time football player. He might like to talk a little bit out there on the field, but he has the type of game to back it up. And he tacks on the extra point. So with under five minutes left in the third quarter, our score, Florida 7, Florida State 31. Florida to kick. Not a real deep kick, should be returned. Number 20 takes from the 10. They'll get the ball here at the 22 yard line. Florida State comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Number six gets it on the inside. He's out to the 30. Number 42 with a takedown at the 33. And he reeled off a big one there. This offensive line is built to allow this tailback to make plays as you just saw. He's able to get into the open and create some excitement right there. It's first and 10, ball on their own 33. 4 3 defense. Number 16 gives it up the middle. Number 43 tackles him for a loss on the play. This is what you call a run blitz. The key is quickly penetrate and disrupt the running back, not allowing him to follow his blockers. Here the defense does a good job and comes up with a nice stop. Second and 11, ball on the 32-yard line. 4-3 defense. Number 16 off the fake. He's looking for his man. Incomplete pass. 
And he let his receiver a little too much. One of the things you look for when you have a young quarterback is how he releases the football. Here you can see he releases the ball a little bit early, a sign that he wasn't completely comfortable with what he was seeing. Third and 11 coming up here. Ball on the 32-yard line. Florida State in a five-wide set. Number 16 drops back to pass. He passes it. Number 21 has it. Number one brings him down at the 45-yard line. Not a bad play there. Not at all. And if this wide out can continue to make plays like this, allowing them to spread the ball around, this offense is going to be tough to stop. First and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. Florida lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 43 tackles him for a loss on the play. Nice play by the linebacker. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on the 47-yard line. Three-man front defensively. He drops back. He lets it go. And it's caught. Number 51 with a takedown at the 38. And they beat the blitz that time and came away with a nice play. We get third and three here. Seventh play of this drive coming up. Florida comes out in a 4-3. Number 16 gives up the middle. Number 99 brings him down at the 36-yard line. They try to play a little power football there. Yeah, but they got outpowered. Fourth and one coming up. Ball on the 36. The Seminoles line up in an I formation. Here's a counter play. Number 25 with a takedown at the 32. The halfback runs for four yards. It's first and 10. This is the ninth play of this drive. They line up in the shotgun. Number 16, step back to pass. And this one's going to get intercepted. And they badly needed that interception. It's sure going to help. If they can march down the field and score, watch out. We might have a game here. First and 10, ball on their own 20. Florida State brings in the nickel here. Drops the throw. He's looking. Let's it go. Complete. And he's finally taken down at the 45-yard line. That was a heck of a throw. That right there is what Heisman voters are looking at. See how he just zipped it in there? He's got my vote right now. How about you, Kirk? You're right. He's got to be in the top three across the country. It's first and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. Florida State. Comes out in a 3-4. Back to pass. He's under pressure. Number 11 drops it. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 45-yard line. The Gators come out in the ace formation. 44 gets the carry. There's a flag on the play, and he puts it on the turf. They'll bring him down at the 35. Got an inverted inverted race mask, mask, mask on the defense. Five-yard five penalty, five five first touchdown. Five
It's first and ten. Ball on the 30. The Seminole bring in the nickel package. Number eight drops back. He steps up, looks, under pressure, going deep. Oh, my, what a catch. Touchdown. He hauled in the long pass for the touchdown. This receiver is big time, big play. If this were baseball, he'd bat cleanup because he's the biggest home run threat they got. Less than a minute remains in the third quarter with the score, Florida 15, Florida State 31. Florida ready to kick this one off. Number 20 and number one deep to return. Decent kick looks to be returnable. Number 20 takes it at the eight. He spins. They'll go to work at the 26. Number 16 lines up in the shotgun. Number 42 brings him down at the 28-yard line. The quarterback gets a couple on the draw play. It's second down and eight. Ball on their own 28. The Seminoles line up with two tight ends. And he's tackled at the 30. That'll be a two-yard gain. And that's the end of the third quarter. Our score in this one, Florida State 31, Florida 15. And we're ready for the start of the fourth quarter. It's third down and six to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Florida brings in the nickel here. Number 16, back to pass. He lets it go deep down the middle. Incomplete. And that was out of reach for his tight end. It's fourth down and six yards to go. Ball on the 30. No surprise here as they prepare to punt it away. Number one calls for the fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 38. It's first and 10, ball on their own 38. The Gators come out in a two tight end set. Play action, fires a bullet out to the right, and it's caught inside the 30. Number 41 with a takedown at the 27. First and 10, ball on the 27. Florida comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Jake's off attack. Number three brings him down at the 22 yard line. A five yard pickup for the tailback.
It's second down and five to go. Ball on the 22-yard line. Number eight is back in the gun. Looking. Throws it out there. Number two with a catch. Number three with a takedown at the 13. That ball was thrown high. Yeah, but this receiver knew he could jump up and get it. Great play. It's first and 10. Ball on the 13. Two tight ends here. He drops back. Let's it fly. And it falls incomplete. The defense came with a blitz that time, and that might have caused him to misfire that one. It's second down and 10 to go. This is the fifth play of this drive. Number eight lines up in the shotgun. Gives a little pump fake. Ball's loose. Scoops up the loose ball. Tackle at the 32-yard line. And it looks like the big old lineman recovered that one. And it's a good awareness. He made a smart play to get on top of the football. First and 10. Ball on the 32-yard line. Three wideouts here. Number 16 drops back to Pat. He unloads it, and it's incomplete. The clock will stop with that incompletion. Boy, I don't understand that strategy at all. With the lead late in the game, you just need to run the football. That's not a smart decision. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 32. The Gators bring in their dime package. Drops back a pass. He's looking. He goes downtown. And he drops it. And that will stop the clock. Yeah, Brad, that doesn't make too much sense to me. You got the lead. Just run the football. Keep the clock running. Third and 10. Ball on the 32-yard line. The Gators line up in a nickel back. Back to pass. Looks. Fires deep down the left side. Complete. And down he goes at the 38. That last catch puts him over the century mark in yards. I'd say that's a pretty good day's work when you guys absolutely come to. First and ten. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Florida lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 16 gives it up the middle. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Well, the defense really put the clamps down on that run. Boy, Brad, great effort up front by that defense. Second and 12 coming up here. Sixth play of this drive coming up. The Gators put four men up front. There's the play fake. Rifles it over the middle. And that one's fallen incomplete. And a great job that time on defense. Good job here, but let me tell you something. That wideout was left out to dry that time. Woo. Third and 12 coming up on this one. Seventh play of this drive coming up. The Seminole set up in the gun. Number 16 back to throw. Guns it across the middle, and it's caught. Brought down at the 26. And they get the first down. That is unbelievable. Wow, Kirk, this quarterback's showing some big-time nerves out there. Third and long is just like first and 10 to this guy. Yeah, you're right. A lot of poise from this young man. First and ten, ball on the 26. The Gators 
come out in a 34 defense. Number 43 hits it on the inside. Number 25 brings him down at the 22. A four-yard pickup by the fullback. And second down and six to go. This is the ninth play of this drive. Number six lines up in the deep back. I formation. Number 16 steps back to pass. He throws it. Complete. Touchdown. Great route. Great catch. Great score. That's not the first time these kids found the end zone. And my friend, I don't think it'll be his last either. Three touchdowns. Wow, that is impressive. And he hits the PAT. So with just over four minutes remaining in the fourth quarter, the score is Florida State 38, Florida 15. Florida State lines up for the kickoff. Kicks it off. Number one, fields it at the three. And he did not have a good kick return on that one. No, some miscommunication there with his blockers. The coverage team just charged right in and took him down. Right. They'll start this drive at the 18. The Gator come out in the shotgun. He drops back. He's looking for his man. Number eight knocks it away. Coach, he made a nice defensive play there. He sure did. He just stuck his hand out and hit the football. Right. And second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 18. Number 44 alone in the backfield. Right. On the ground, up the middle. Number 45 with a takedown at the 21. That'll be a gain of three yards. It's third down and seven to go. Ball on the 21. Going with the shotgun here. Number eight drops the throw. Throws a lob pass out to the left. Number six makes a catch, and he's going to lose yards on this one. And they fail to convert for the first down. Well, the offense hates to see that. The defense again, Coach, stepping up. The defense is important. It wins football games for you. Fourth and 11 coming up. Ball on the 17-yard line. The Gator line up to punt. Number 20 signals for a fair catch. He hauls it in at the 48. They'll take over at the 48 yard line. Number six lines up in the deep back, eye formation. Number 16 gives it up the middle. They'll bring him down at the 48. They got four yards on that one. It's second down and six to go. Ball right around midfield. Florida lines up defensively in a 3-4. Number 
three on the inside handoff. Number 25 brings him down at the 40. And remember one thing that this coach said. They will force it down this defense's throat until they prove that they can stop it. First and 10, ball on the 40-yard line. Number six is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Cut. 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 Number 16 gives it up the middle. How about that defensive stop? That's a great effort by the defensive line there. Anytime you can get into the backfield and disrupt the timing of a run like this, you're going to come up with a big stop. Second and 15, ball on the 45. The Seminole come to the line with their jumbo package. Handoff up the middle. And he's taken down at the 42-yard line. And they continue to pound it out on the ground. Tick, tick, tick. Continue to milk that clock. Third down and 12. Ball on the 42-yard line. Florida brings in the nickel here. They hand it off. He jukes him. Number 86 with a takedown at the 42-yard line. The Gators call for a timeout, and that was their first timeout. It's fourth and 12 yards to go. Ball on the 42-yard line. Florida State ready to put this one away. Number one calls for the fair catch. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They'll get the ball here at the 20-yard line. The Seminole line up with six defensive backs. And it's caught. And they make the stop at the 31-yard line. The offense calls a timeout. That was their second timeout. First and 10. Ball on their own 31. Number eight has five receivers lined up here. Number eight back to pass. He passes it. And it's knocked away. The corner almost came up with a big turnover there. Well, the corner's able to bat this ball away, but he'd love another opportunity there to make the catch. They're not going to like to hear me say this, but that's one of the reasons why they're on defense and not playing offense. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 31. They line up in an eye. Number eight drops back. He lets it go. Complete. Missed tackle. And he's tackled at the 41-yard line. A good play to the tight end that time. Yeah, and this is a play that we saw him practice the other day over and over again. And as a coach, you like it when all that practice pays off and your players execute in the game like they did all week in practice. Good job. Back to pass. Here comes the pressure. Let's it go. Incomplete pass. Coach, he underthrew that one. <laughs> That's one of those passes where he's trying too hard to throw the ball away from the defender. He ended up missing his own receiver. It is fourth down and inches. Ball on the 41-yard line. So they're set to punt this one away. Number 20 signals for a fair catch. And they'll down it at the five. They'll go to work at the five yard line. The Seminole line up in an eye formation. Gives it up the middle. Brought down at the seven-yard line. Short little game there. Just trying to keep that clock running. 
Keep that clock running and keep that other offense off the field. And that's pretty much going to do it. Any final thoughts on this one, Coach? Hey, who said they could win this football game? Florida State is a good-looking football team. And you know what? They were not intimidated by anyone. I said it before, and I'll say it again. You can never, ever count this football team out. They're too good, and they have too much pride. Thanks for watching this game of NCAA Football 2003. The final count in this one, Florida State 38. Florida 15. Brad Nessler for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet signing off. So long, everybody.